Hey guys, my name is Jamin. This is my channel PC Monkey, where I try to bring you a wide variety of do-it-yourself computer upgrade and repair videos. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Windows 11 install media USB. If you're here by mistake and you wanted to see a video showing you how to use the USB to install Windows onto a computer, check out this video link right here. That'll take you to the correct video. In this video, I'm going to just show you how to create the USB for free. Before we begin guys, two quick things. First, please remember to like, share, subscribe if this was helpful. If I do help you out, help you solve a problem and you want to support the channel a little more, feel free to drop me a super thanks. Even a couple bucks goes a long way to me making these videos and being as available as possible to answer your comments and questions. If you do have a question and you don't see it below in the FAQs in the description, leave me a message. I do try to get to those a couple times a day at least. Second quick thing, a shout out to my sponsor, NiceHash. NiceHash is the world's largest hash power marketplace. What that means for you is you can now rent out your computer's unused power online to people who mine cryptocurrency and you get paid for that in Bitcoin. It's a great way to earn some money on the side with no work. It's a great way to start learning the world of crypto with no risk. You can click here for more information or I'll fill you in a little more on the end of the video. Now let's get into the project. First thing you're going to want to do is go to the Microsoft website link here. That'll take you to where you need to download the Windows install media. So after coming to this link, you're going to see these options. You're going to see the Windows 11 install assistant download now. You're going to see the create Windows 11 installation media download now. This is the option here that you would choose if you were upgrading your current computer to Windows 11. And that way you don't have to create a USB, you just click on that and your computer upgrades. But again, we are creating a USB install media for use on another computer. So we would want this option here. Just to double check what you need to make sure you, your USB is okay, if you click on this plus extender, it shows you the specs you need for your computer and for your USB. I'm using a 16 gigabyte, so I should be all set. So I'm going to go ahead and minimize that. And I'm going to then click on download now after taking my USB, plugging it in on the side. I'm going to hit download now. There's the media creation tool there. I'm going to right click on that notification, show in folder. There it is. I'm going to double click on that to get it running. Do you want to allow this app to make changes? Yes, I do. Just some terms and conditions, accept. Select language and addition, that's all okay. I'm going to hit next. And then again, USB flash drive, that's where I want to install it. Next. Just to double check, I guess, right there. Next. One thing to remember guys, if this is erroring out somehow, if it's telling you that it can't proceed and can't make this USB for some reason, try formatting the USB. If you're sure it's the right size, try formatting it first before using it like this. Um, after this process is done, I'll show you really quickly how you can format your USB. It only takes a few seconds. Your USB flash drive is ready, all right, so we're going to click on finish. It'll finish up some things and then it's all done. So that is how you would create a Windows install media USB. Please like, share, subscribe if this was helpful. Uh, as mentioned in the video, I'm going to show you how to reformat your USB in case you came up with some errors there. Before I do that, as mentioned earlier, I wanted to fill you in a little more on my sponsor NiceHash. As mentioned before, NiceHash is the world's largest hash power marketplace. And again, what that means is you can rent out your computer's unused, untapped power online to people who mine cryptocurrency, and then you get paid for that in Bitcoin. It's a great way to start earning some side money with no work. It's also a great way to start investigating the world of crypto with no added investment and no risk to your investment. You can use their wallets to store it. You can use their research tools to research other cryptocurrencies, and you can use their exchange to trade in other cryptocurrencies. So it's a great way to get in there. It's a great way to earn some money. Check out this link for more information or leave me any comments if you have them. Now I'm going to show you how to reformat your USB if that's needed. After plugging in your USB, you're going to want to go to your file explorer, scroll down to the USB right here, right click on it, 
and where it says format near the top, click on that. And then hit start. It's going to warn you formatting will erase all data on this disk and we're going to hit yes. Format complete, not a very long step. That's how you would reformat your USB if that's needed. Uh, thanks so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you on my next video.